If Daniel Cormier beats Frank Mir, should he get the next UFC heavyweight title shot? You can cast your vote at that at uncensoredlive.spike.com. Let's back the truck up on that one second, though. First off, who do you like in the fight? I just want to say, Frank, why are you taking this fight, man? <laughs> that answers you know, that. <laughs> you, you know, he's just coming off a loss. He got knocked out. Like, you need to rebuild yourself. Get your confidence bad. And Cormier's a beast. He just won the Strike Force Heavyweight Tournament, a fast-paced five-round fight with Barnett. And Barnett's a badass, and he beat him. So, I mean, it just, Frank, not a good fight right now for him. It's really his performance against Barnett that sets the stage for this. Cormier just ran right through him. It's going to be his well, day. Well, Barnett listen, fought a tough fight. I mean, did. It's a tough fight, but listen, everybody wins yeah. here. If Cormier wins, he looks good. If he loses, that's kind of bad. But even if Frank Mir loses, the reason why it's so great is because if you're going to lose to him, lose to him in strike force when you're doing Zufa a favor. When they all go back to the UFC, he's going to get a big-name opponent with a big, fat paycheck. I fail to see the problem here. <laughs> well, the web poll, about 70% of our respondents right now think he should get the immediate title shot. What do you think? Well, he's beaten. He, he will have beaten Frank Mir. Frank Mir coming off a loss. That doesn't mean as much, you know. He deserves a title shot, I think, more so because he won that heavyweight strike force tournament. That's true, but the, listen, here's the reality. Who are they going to give him? The Tim Sylvia thing moves the needle not at all. At least there is attention. It's a big ratings bonanza for Showtime. That furthers that relationship with Zufa. I, I really think everyone is not understanding the terms of this deal.